Okay. 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 Did you get the what I sent you email? Did you glance it? Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Well, then just check it out later. Check it out later. Okay. Yeah, she's on. She's on right now, but she hasn't started yet. No, it's not yet. She's getting ready to. Not yet. Getting ready to. Okay. All right. Bye bye. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, welcome. This is our virtual hair party. Welcome. My name is Kathy Weathersby, and I'm so proud to be joined by our resident expert, Doris Mosley. So I'm so excited to have her here. She always gives us fantastic nuggets about our system. First, I do want to share with you some information about Wakana. So again, welcome everybody to our virtual hair party. We just appreciate you guys spending your Monday afternoon with us. So if you are a hair care professional, if you are a guest that has been invited by a hair care professional or one of our distributors, let them know that you appreciate this. And I'm telling you, you're going to love being able to hear from our trichologist, our expert. I will give her her due introduction in just a moment. So let me share the screen with you. Just one moment. There we go. And nope, I'm not ready to share yet. Not quite ready to share. Let's go back to this. There we go. Now we're ready to share the screen. Welcome again. Can you hear me clearly, uh, Doris? Yes. All right. I feel like I'm a little low, so I'm going to turn that up. All righty. And can you see my screen? Yes. Live. Awesome. Awesome. Well, we are Wakana. We are the crown jewel of CBD. You see, we are a company that is not just a company, but we're a movement with a vision. We exist to help end the negative stigma that's caused communities around the world to suffer and lose out on the health and wealth benefits of the cannabis plant. In fact, we have a serious mission to be a catalyst that stirs the movement to inspire people to confidently move into the legal space as entrepreneurs, formulators, and investors evoking the courage and strength of people to take back their health, wealth, legacy, and freedom. We were founded by four African-American women who put their synergistic efforts and talents together to formulate Wakana as the crown jewel of CBD. On our left, we have our first pillar, our chief medical officer, Dr. Rita J. McGuire, a 30-year veteran as an ob gyne and is now an expert in cannabis, using our products with her patients along with traditional medicine. This expert was sought after uh, by the legislature in Illinois to assist them in understanding the rules that they should understand with compliance and passing those laws uh, on cannabis in Illinois. Dr. Patricia Van Pelt serves as our chief financial officer as a certified accountant an evangelist and third time state senator. She's a perfect person at the helm as our wealth pillar. Our visionary and CEO is Melissa Boston. This is a woman who retired herself from corporate America, moving in to the arena of the home-based business, social selling, um, uh, network marketing industry, building teams in over 46 countries and becoming a mentor to thousands. We have our CSO, our chief sales officer, Phyllis Nash, with over 30 years of experience in both traditional and home-based business. She's perfectly positioned to be our chief sales officer as she is our first diamond, our first double diamond, and we affectionately call her our midwife as she helps our sales force to birth 
all of their sales goals. This is a company who has broken records with over $4 million in cumulative sales in less than two years. Now, CBD, our subject today in our hair party, is legal. It became legal first in 2014. One of the goals of the 2014 Farm Bill was to generate and protect research into hemp. Under the 2018 Farm Bill, hemp is treated like other agricultural commodities in many ways. And this is an important point. While there are provisions that heavily regulate hemp, this legislation make hemp, makes hemp a mainstream crop. And therefore, you saw CBD popping up everywhere. In fact, the cannabis industry is booming, going from illegal to now essential. And the revenue is moving into the billions, looking to reach over $20 billion in just 2024. That's just a few years away from now. Perfectly positioned is Wakana, participating in billion dollar industries. In the, in the CBD market, $7 billion. In the weight loss market, which is a $288 billion industry. The $3.4 trillion wellness and immune industry. The $20 billion essential oils industry. The $190 billion skincare industry. And today's subject, the $87 billion hair industry. So what is CBD? CBD stands for cannabidiol, which is a compound that naturally occurs in industrial hemp. And out of the more, more than 85 different cannabinoids, it's the second most common next to Delta 9 tetrahydrocannabinol. This is THC. You probably heard of THC, right? But unlike THC, CBD is non-psychotropic and produces the health without the high. Our products are fully compliant with the State Department of Agriculture and are grown in accordance with Section 7606 of the 2018 Farm Bill. So folks, it's really just a matter of learning and unlearning. Well, you're probably familiar with the, the most prominent cannabinoid, THC. It does give you that high, producing psychotropic effects it actually stimulates the pleasure center of the brain, releasing higher than normal dopamine. But CBD is non-intoxicating, stimulating different areas of the brain, those that regulate pain and perception and nausea and anxiety. Medical applications with CBD include anti-inflammatory and pain relief. This is a great chart to help you understand the vast difference between CBD and marijuana. You see, THC has been touted to help uh, with pain and nausea and muscle spasms. But if you look here in this column under CBD, you'll see that there's so many different benefits that come along with CBD, not only reducing pain and nausea, but increasing bone growth and uh, reducing tumor growth helping with psoriasis, additional, additionally helping with, helping with seizures and slowing bacteria growth, relieving anxiety and benefiting the nervous system and the arteries, reducing inflammation, muscle spasms, and psychosis. I mean, so you can see that CBD gives you the health without the high in so many different areas. And the reason why CBD works so well for so many people is the endocannabinoid system. We have this system throughout our bodies that is the most regulatory system known to man. It really, it literally helps to determine how you think, how you feel, how you react. And these receptors are all over your body, in your heart, your eyes, your lungs, your liver, your kidneys, your brain, your bowels, your stomach, your skin, and your teeth. So if you think back to the chart that I mentioned to you earlier, just a couple slides ago, you can see how if those receptors are in these areas, how CBD can give you so many benefits. This is our wonderful product line. You see, we created this line not only to be compliant and efficient, but to give you options, to give you options on getting CBD in your body any way you like, whether topically, 
with some of our uh, cream and some of our uh, um, other products like our lube and our lotions and our balms to, to our tinctures that you put under the tongue, to our pre-rolls, to our um, edibles. We actually have products that hit each one of those industries that we talked about. CBD, skincare, essential oils, weight loss, the wellness industry, as well as what our subject is today, hair care. We've even produced a line that's going to help you with your love life. You see, we actually have a Valentine pack that you are going to love, including uh, products that are going to increase your libido, um, keep you so silky and smooth, and actually help you um, with your lovemaking. So with that said, I want to share with you our disclaimer. While you're uh, reading this, I just want to share with you what it says. This product is not for use, for sale to persons under the age of 18. Our Smokable hemp is not available to anyone under the age of 21. It should only be used directed as on the label. And if you are nursing or pregnant, you should not be using this. You want to consult with a physician before use if you have any serious medical conditions or use prescription medications. A doctor's advice should be sought before using this in any other supplemental dietary product. Our statements have, these statements have not been evaluated by the FDA. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. By using our website, you agree to follow the policy and procedures there. Um, Wakanda for Life does not sell or distribute any products that are in violation of any United States Controlled Substances Act. And you want to review our website for our full disclaimer and to read about smokable hemp and the Delta 8 ban in certain states. And with that, I'm going to stop sharing my screen and introduce our expert. This is a woman who has 39 years. I'm sorry, not 39, 47, right? I don't know where I got 39 from. I just pulled that out of the air. Um, <laughs> but it's 46 years of experience in hair care. She's an expert. In fact, she's a trichologist, which means that she's the absolute expert to let you know anything about the hair, the scalp, how it grows, how it falls out, how it could come back if it can come back. This is the lady here to speak with. She is the founder of the uh, Spectrum International Beauty Expo, the largest Southern California expo out there. She's a sought after trainer. And I'm, I'm telling you, she's become a great friend. I just love this lady. I love her energy and her knowledge. Every single week, I learn something new. I want to bring up from LA, Doris Mosley. Wow, Kathy, you know what? I look back, but I realize if I look any further, I'll be out of my window. But I'm excited <laughs> about being That a was you. That was you. <laughs> and 39, by the way, that's my age, Kathy. That's why you said 39. <laughs> that's what it was. I yeah. knew I got that mixed up with something. <laughs> but you know what? I appreciate all of you guys who are joining us because I always say, you know, time is something that we can't get back. But fortunately, here at Wakana, if you got a hair follicle, there's a great possibility that you can get your hair back. And we just love our roots, love your roots. Um, as, as a result of health care challenges, improper and or hair services, the need for hair replacement and camouflage has become the number one necessary and requested service in salons everywhere. And we got to do something. Medical term for baldness is simply alopecia. And there's three types of alopecia. There's alopecia areata. That's when the one or, or more circular false patches uh, occur and sometimes overlaps. Uh, alopecia totalis, this is a term used to describe when you're experiencing a complete total baldness uh, of the scalp. And sometimes the eyelashes and eyebrows are affected. Alopecia universalis, is the medical condition used to describe the loss of all body hairs, including eyebrows, eyelashes, armpits, and everywhere there is a follicle. And you're born with over 5 million follicles over the entire body. 
And it's an estimated, you know, hair loss is really big business. And it's estimated 3.6 billion in 2016. So, you know, we're in 2021 now. So, you know what it has happened. One in five Americans are losing their hair. And that is serious. It is not an epidemic. And there's reasons for hair loss. There's diet. You are what you eat. You know, and I get so tired of people go eating corn and expecting, uh, planting corn and expecting tomatoes to grow. And that's what we do a lot. We eat one thing and expect another. Stress. We are all stressing right now. Even the children are stressing. The pets are stressing. We are living in a climate today where stress is just here. It's how we receive the stress. Medical Medical, we're taking a lot of medication because there are a lot of illnesses out there, chronic illness, traumatic illness. We just de deal with a lot of issues. And the more uh, issues we deal medically, the more medication we're taking. And most of the time, it's, the side effects is definitely hair loss. Genetics, it can be from either one of the parents. Androgenetic, it's one of the leading causes. If your mother is, your father is, it's just going to speed it up. And environmental, how are you styling your hair? What tools are you using to style your hair? How are you styling? Are you changing your style often? Are you keeping the same style? We got to look at all of that here at Wakana. The types of hair stresses, we already talked about chronic, traumatic, braiding. Braiding is, is, is very popular today, but it's tight, stressful braiding could cause hair loss. Ponytails, I think of ponytails when I think of little children how they're losing their hair, aggressive brushing. Brushing is good, it's very stimulating to the blood circulation, but aggressive, excessive is too much and we can cause problems. Traction alopecia, look to the left of the screen, is a perfect example of uh, traction alopecia. Somewhere, this, this young lady was misled. At some point, she should have been changing her hairstyle or getting rid of the braids or getting rid of the added weave hair, the commercial hair. It didn't do her justice. She has no edges. And that's why we have the frontals and the, the, the closures. Very familiar face here. It doesn't have no, uh, it does not discriminate. Hair loss is everywhere. But thank God, Wakana once again stepped up to the plate and knocked it out of the park. And they have a system here that is working, you guys. Let me tell you, people are excited. They're already calling in, giving their testimonies about the Saving Our Strand system. It's a hair care system that we're kind of put together with some of the top of the line ingredients, starting with the shampoo. The shampoo is very, I mean, when I tell you, it's a shampoo that gives you exactly what you need to balance out the hair. It has rosemary oil in it. I like to always feature a couple of the oils that are in there. And the rosemary oil, leaf oil, it helps relieve itchy scalp. Itchy scalp can be very annoying. And if you go and dig into scalp like most people do, they can end up damaging that follicle. And that follicle is what nourishes the strand. Once you lose a follicle, you have lost a strand of hair forever. There's no um, resurrecting a, a follicle. So we have um, the rosemary leaf oil, which help relieve that itchy scalp. It also improved at the cellular level. I had an opportunity to interview uh, oncologists and I just simply asked her, at what point do people lose their hair when they get in chemo? And she said, Doris, it happens at the cellular level. So I'm just saying to you, if it happens at the cellular level, why don't we go ahead of that? Hopefully we never have to have it, but we go ahead of that and help with the cellular level as far as <clears throat> nourishing that scalp help deep cleanse the cuticle layer. Now, if you don't know where the cuticle layer is, it is the first layer of the strand of hair, okay? It is the first layer of the strand of hair. And if you can definitely deep cleanse the cuticle layer, you will always be conditioning with the conditioner and not conditioning over conditioner, because you gotta cleanse the cuticle. That's what gives the hair that nice shine. Uh, and you all, we also have laurel leaf oil. It helped boost and promote hair growth. That's what we're all about here at Wakana. We're trying to restore the hair. It prevents excessive hair loss. We, we know we're going to lose some hair. We lose a hair on a daily basis, but we don't want to go to the excessive screen. We lose anywhere from a 50 to 100 strands a day. 
But now, if you have those what called protective styles, you're going to still lose it, but it's not going to leave the head because it's not going to be combed off. It's not going to be blown out with the wind. So, but if you're using, and it has been proven in my practice, when we use our hemp powered hair as oil as a treatment, we would lose less hair. And it's also an astringent, would help tighten the grip of the hair, hair root. And that's important. Uh, it prevents hair loss. We want to prevent hair loss here at, at Wakana. We don't want you to lose hair excessively. We know we're going to lose some, but we don't want to lose it excessively. So that's real important, you guys. And then we have, we have the hemp-powered hair detangling conditioner. The conditioner that stays, that you leave in the hair, okay? It leave, it's a leave-in detangler. And the leave-in detangler, it helps in many different ways also. Um, we have the organic jojoba seed oil. You've heard of jojoba, how good it is. It's moisturized. It's a moisturizer. And in hair, we have two main components. We have the moisturizer and we have the protein. So this is one of the moisturizers, rich in vitamins and minerals that nourish the hair, including vitamins C, B, E, copper, and zinc. It prevents hair loss and promotes hair thickness. And who doesn't want a thick head of hair? It strengthens the hair also. And it helps and it helps thickens it. So we want to make sure that we maintain as many of those hundred thousand plus strands that's in the hair that we were born with. But some of us, we we don't believe it. So we what we do, we end up. Uh, not holding on to what we have. So we got to make sure that we use the system. And it's nothing like a system because what a system does, it um, save you time, energy, and money. That's what a system is all about. And we also have our moisturizing conditioner. The moisturizing conditioner does just what it says. It adds moisture, which we need in our hair, and it also nourishes the hair. And the one thing I can say about uh, this system here, what kind of took their time and they researched the ingredients that will make the hair stronger, last longer on the head. And hair, like Kathy was saying, how the CBD, and we have CBD in our product, but how it goes into the different system. Now hair is an appendage of skin and it also it's the, the, it has, it is the barometer of the body. It lets you know when something is going on in the body. So if you're losing excessive hair, you need to check that out because something is going on. That's why when, when Wakanda was researching ingredients, they got ingredients that will help maintain healthy hair from the inside out. When it, remember when it said, love your roots? You have to love your roots because that's where everything is coming in from. And I always say those ingredients are so awesome. They bond together like a chain, starting with, I always call hemp powered hair, my baby. Starting with the baby, all of those ingredients came together, which a black seed oil is right up on your screen, will naturally moisturize your scalp, reducing itchy and dryness. That's important. Then you have the rosemary oil. Again, rosemary oil is a natural DHT blocker. And one of these days, we're going to spend more time on DHT because I want you to understand that is nothing that can be detected with the naked eye. You have to really have a biopsy to, for that. Pumpkin seed oil helps get rid of inflammation. Inflammation is one, one of the leading, leading causes of hair loss. And Dr. Rita talk about inflammation all the time and how we got to get rid of inflammation. We got what it takes to get rid of inflammation. MCT oil, which is a coconut oil, can help speed hair growth process when combined with other nutrients. Moringa is fight disease and promotes good health. If you don't have good health, like right now I am fighting a cold and I hate to even say it because when you say cold today, people run from you. But anyway, I'm definitely fighting that. But Bell Bar provide vitamin C and iron. And I've been on my hemp cranium, Kathy, trying to feel better. 
uh, peppermint promotes blood circulation. It's nothing like having good blood circulation. I always tell hairstylists, when you uh, put a client back in the shampoo bowl, look at their ankles. If they got swollen ankles and all of that, they have some circulation problems. So they need to seek a doctor. But we want to make sure that we have the product that help works from the outside in. And our cinnamon is a, a great um, antioxidant. Oh my goodness, they thought of everything. Lemon oil, grass, it's an antiseptic. It helps cleanse, you gotta cleanse that scalp good. Deep cleanse those pores, which help get in hemp powered hair, get out all the toxins. Skin is the largest organ of elimination. So we gotta make sure we are eliminating properly. Clove reduces the rate of hair fallout and promotes hair growth. Wild salmon oil, I love wild salmon oil. I had salmon for dinner yesterday, but I can't eat enough to do what needs to be done. So it's in our hair product. Wild salmon oil can make omega-3, typically omega-3s, which can make your hair shiny, stronger, and reduce skin dryness that can often lead to itchy scalp or dandruff. And we, of course, we have CBD, which brings the body back into balance. That's exciting. And like I say again, we kind of put it all together. And those, all those ingredients is like a chain that cannot be broken. Hair follicles, that's important. You do not want a follicle hysterectomy, meaning it's a dead, they're dead. There are over 5 million follicles over the entire body. At least 100,000 of those follicles make it to the head. You don't want to lose one. Hair follicles, <clears throat> hemp-powered hair stimulates the follicle and promote healthy scalp and hair. The follicles support and nourishes the strand. Loss of a follicle means loss of hair. And most times people don't really realize they have lost until they have lost 51% of their hair. And I am so excited about the Wakana Save Our Strands Beauty Bar. I don't know how many of you all remember the show Cheers, but I thought about Cheers when we thought about the SOS Beauty Bar how when people would go into the bar and they say, everybody know your name, everybody glad you came. Well, that's how we're gonna be with, with the beauty bar. And it's gonna happen the third Monday of every month at the same time, you're gonna come into the beauty bar and we're gonna have conversation. And some of the conversations we are gonna have is just gonna be so amazing. And we want you to invite all the people you know, because my mission, you guys, and I want you, to help me fulfill our, the mission for Wakana. And that is to have our system, saving our strand system to be a household salon hole name, not just here in the US, but all over the world. We want that to be the most requested um, hair products ever. And, and our mission is, is just that. We know what we have. We don't know whether you know what we have. As Kathy said, this is a movement. This is not something we plan with you guys. The beauty industry is over $473 million plus, plus. And we want part of that, if not all of that, but we won't be greedy, but we do want our fair share. And we know with you on our side, you can be, uh, make that happen. And it's not only gonna happen for Wakana, it's going to happen for you also. So we want you to get so familiar with coming into the beauty bar and we're going to have co uh, conversation topics. We're going to also spotlight salons and we're just going to have a great time. The beauty bar is going to turn this whole industry around because when you walk out of the beauty bar, you're going to say, I'm so glad I came because when you walk out of there, you're not going to just hear from me. You're not just going to hear from our awesome CEO, a Kathy, who just been so awesome. You're going to hear from people all over the world who's going to share their knowledge and their findings. And the system is just amazing. So, hey, back to you, Kathy or Melissa. And uh, it's just been rough trying to get through this, but I'm here. No, you did a great job, Doris. That was wonderful. I, you fought through that. You fought the good fight. So thank you. <laughs> Kathy, I'm going to turn it over to you, dear. You guys did an amazing job. I know there's probably questions, but thank you both so much. Thank you, Melissa. You're so awesome. Listen, um, and, and Doris, I want to tell you that I'm loving your starter locks. They're looking real good today. 
Really looking good. My granddaughter did it for the first time. Yeah, looks really, really nice. The first time? Yes. Well, I mean, she must have learned her techniques from the pro. Okay. Because, uh, 17, hey. First time doing them. She's been watching you, apparently. Yeah, she put my hemp powered hair on there and everything. Looking real sharp, my friend. And yes, you look every bit of 38. You really, you got it going on, girlfriend. You got well, it going on. Well, speaking of the starter likes, Kathy, Doris, you didn't really share your story because a lot of times people who are joining new don't realize you suffered hair loss issues. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, definitely tell us because that looks really good. You know what? Right in this area here, I was diagnosed with CCCA. And CCCA is central. It starts in the top. And I know if you're a hairstylist on this, on this Zoom, you've seen this. And it starts to spread out. Centrifugal, meaning spreading out. Cicatricia, meaning scar tissue was up here. And of course, I panicked like most of us will. And I said, I, I cannot lose my hair. Because why am I talking about hair loss and hair restoration? I can't save my own self. So I got on the ingredients. Uh, what kind of ingredients was just amazing. And what I did, I started using it. And I, my daughter, journal, uh, she did a journal for me. So she started putting it up here. And I said, Lily, I don't want to see it because I didn't want to stress no more. So she took pictures. And about two months later, she showed me. And it was coming back in. I said, oh, Lily, I can see the difference. Eight months later, I was back, all my hair back. And I was so excited. And I said to, um, I tell everybody, this is not an overnight uh, success. You have to have patience. But see what most people do, they buy the product, they'll use it a couple of days, then they'll put it on the shelf, and they'll come back and say, girl, that product didn't work for me. And you got a bottle full. No, it didn't work. It don't work on the shelf. It does not work in the bottle. It works only on your scalp. How do you use it? Three days a week, you put it on your scalp, do not, and Kathy always demonstrate, but do not let the bottom nozzle touch your scalp. And, and you can also put it on your, I got my bottle over here right on my nightstand. But anyway, you don't put it on your, the, you don't let the nozzle, Kathy, you got it? Yeah, you don't let the nozzle touch your scalp or your hair because you don't want to contaminate your, contaminate your product. You want to drop it in and gently massage it in. Then you want to put it under your tongue and you don't want the nozzle to touch your tongue. You put it under your tongue and you hold it for about 60 seconds. And then you let, um, you, then you swallow. Then as a treatment, you take it and you take 12 drops and put it in a half an ounce to an ounce of water. Because like Kathy wearing locks, right? And so her locks, she, she want to get all of it in, but she just can't drop 12 drops on her locks and make it happen. She puts it in water, 12 drops of water. Uh, I'm not 12 drops of water, 12 drops of oil, hemp powered hair oil into a half an ounce or an ounce of water, depending on how much hair you have. Then you 50% dry the hair and then you spray it on and finish drying it the rest of the way. Now, if you're wearing a weave, meaning you're wearing commercial hair, don't worry about the commercial hair, open up your scalp, spray it directly on your braids, and then you finish drying the rest of the way. Now, I noticed that the people who does that, they do not have excessive hair loss when they take their weave out. Let me tell you guys, I'm not saying this because I work, I'm working with this team. I'm saying it's because it's true. Tried, tested, and effective. So we're gonna make this happen, it's, but it's up to you. I can't make you do it, but I definitely can tell you that some people say, oh, Doris, is it oily? oily it's not oily like that but if it was i wouldn't care i'd rather have oily hair than no hair so i tell people don't worry about the oil but it's not oily that's going to weight your hair down it's very light oil but let me tell you it main thing it works providing you have a follicle after the follicle is gone it's not gonna work i'm not gonna tell you it's gonna work no and, and I'm, oh, and Kathy's not gonna tell you that not at all. I'm glad that you brought that up because our first question is uh, from Kimberly. She says she wants to try it. I want a product that will help grow my client's hair back. Can you speak on that? 
Kimberly, that is an awesome question. And let me tell you, I've had great success, not only me, but other people also from their testimonies. But what you want to do, you want to get the product, get the system. We have a system now. I kept saying to Melissa, Melissa, we need a system. We need a system first for cleansing. We need a system first for, for moisturizing. We need a system that's going to help strengthen it here. <laughs> They researched the ingredients and they brought us a system that has ingredients that all of them are targeted, aimed at restoring hair. So Kimberly, I advise you to give it a chance, but just don't look for it to be happening next day. Like some people call me up, this day, I was no. Then when they get on it right, then they'll call back. You were right. Yes. If it, you have the follicle, nine times out of 10, it's going to work for you. It just take a little time because hair only grows six inches a year. So you can do the math, six inches a year. So it takes a little long sometimes, but it, I'm living proof. Look, I could have been completely bald up here, but I, I'm not. Thank you. I'm so glad to have that. Cause I, I can imagine that trauma of thinking of that, you know? You know, men, we expect to see have more bald issues, but because society is so harsh on the looks of women that, you know, when you have something like a pattern baldness or the CCC that you had or thinning edges, we are quick to cover it up just so nobody sees it without actually treating it. So I'm so glad that you're here and you help formulate these products that actually provide a solution. Um, Ernestine wants to know, Go ahead. No, there's a question from Kimberly. Wanted to know, I read her question. Wanted to know, can you still put a weave in uh, using a product? Kimberly, I'm going to say to you, yes, you can. But I just want you to be very mindful that when you're braiding for a weave, you don't braid with a lot of tension. It's not necessary. You see my hairline here? I have a hairline because I'm very conscious of braiding, twisting, any of the things that's going to cause stress to my hair, I do not do it because your hair is going to grow anyway. So it's no sense in braiding it so tight. I used to get a weed put in to go out of town and they would braid me so tight. I thought I was another nationality. <laughs> I got a face. I, got a face. I couldn't even put my head on the pillow. That didn't make sense. Not at all. So, yeah. <laughs> I hadn't heard that one before you got me. I was went in looking one way and came out looking another. I was cute. I was in pain. I'm sure you were cute and in pain. Oh my God. It makes sense. But Kim, make sure you use your product. If you can avoid putting on a weave, avoid it. Take them to a wig. That would be best. But if you could avoid it. Because that way you can really get to the scalp. And once a week, you can really treat them and they can treat themselves. See what I do, I open up this bottle for my client. Now they already know they're going to buy this bottle. Because <laughs> I open up a new bottle every time for a client. So they know they need this. I'm going to open up this bottle. And when I put it on, the only thing they're going to say is how much. How much is it? And they got it because they need to use it three times a week. They're not coming to me three times a week. So they need to take it home. That's right. Um, to earn it, to answer your uh, question, Ernestine, there is conditioner on the site now, isn't that right, Daryl Doris? Yeah, yeah. The moisturizing conditioner is on the site individually. Um, let's see. A customer wants to know. Uh, got that one answered. We've got the conditioner answered. Uh, a potential customer asked if she could use the product line on her hair because she does a keratin treatment. Oh, yes. Yes. She really need to use it if she's doing a keratin treatment. Yes. Tell us more about what that is, Doris. That keratin treatment is where, um, which I never recommended it because of what it does. You have to have, a, I think if they still using a mask to, to, to put it on, it's where they, I think they steam it uh, or flat iron it in or something like that. I never really use it, Kathy. Is this a straightening type of a treatment? I think it is. But when they okay. told me that I had to use a mask back in the day, I was like, that is something I'm not going to use. 
If as a professional, you mean you don't mask, use it. Right. If I have to use a mask, that means something in there I'm not supposed to be inhaling. I hear you. So I would wow. So I never That's powerful. And I said to one of the, I was at a show one time and I said to the guy who was promoting it and I asked him, I said, what would this do to my hair? Because it has, I think it has style in it. And he, he had to, and I questioned him to no end. He had to be truthful because he knew I knew exactly what I was talking about. So he came with the truth. It's not really good for our texture, but we use it. I hear you. What can be used on dry, itchy scalp? Uh, our shampoo, our nourishing shampoo for starters, because it has ingredients in there that could help eliminate that. Then our hemp powered hair, it has black seed oil in it. So it's going to help. It has pumpkin seed. It has all of those things. You use it, drop those drops on your scalp, massage it in and it helps. I really love getting my scalp stimulated, but I use the hemp powered hair and I'm like, what happened to my my scalp? I want my itchy scalp back so I can get my scalp stimulated. So use the um, hemp powered hair is really good, really good. What causes a dry itchy scalp? It all depends. It could be clogged pores. It can be uh, something happening within. You're not getting enough um, water. You know, your body is like 85, 90% water. And most people don't even drink water. So if they're not drinking water, that means that they're dehydrating. There's dehydration. And if you're not cleansing properly, just like the, the shampoo, you can add a little baking soda to the shampoo and, and do the scalp facial. You should do a, your scalp facial at least once a month. And that's taking that, adding that, and just rotating on the scalp to, de, uh, to um, exfoliate those pores, to deep cleanse them. And I'm telling you, if you do that, you will definitely deep cleanse the pores. And, it, and it's just amazing how it comes out. That's awesome. Thank you, Margie. Um, uh, Margie was complimenting us on our hair, um, Doris. And uh, yes, Katrina, this recording will be available later. Um, uh, actually, Alice would like you to go back over what's in the Saving Our Strands kit. Uh, we have the, um, the nourishing shampoo. Okay. If you, if, let me I'll look. share the screen. Mm -hmm. okay, guys, we'll share the screen, guys. And okay, just to I'll answer it, Ernestine real quick, guys. So Ernestine, that moisturizing conditioner, you should be able to order it now. We did restrict some of the products because we wanted to make sure we had all the kits fulfilled, but we just got the green light from operations. So as of maybe two seconds ago, you should be able to order that moisturizer. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lucky question, right? <laughs> yeah, the, the renewing shampoo, the moisturizing conditioner, the leave-in detangler, the styling cream, and the sleeper for you guys is the oud oil. What? The oud oil, the body oil. I use it on my hair. That's what I use as a side oil. And let me tell you, it's a sleeper. Not only do I use it on my hair, I put it in my body wash, and I give myself a, a, a body wash with it. So it's a sleeper, but it's with our SOS hair care system. Because a lot of people do like to use some oil on their hair. Now, I put the hemp-powered hair oil on the scalp and under the tongue. But for the hair, I use the Oud Body Oil. So, and, and then we have the styling cream. A lot of people do natural twists and stuff. You can just put the styling cream on the, through the hair as you twist. Melissa does that to her hair. It's beautiful. Beautiful. It does. It does like a... Yeah, do the exfoliation the scalp facial with that by just adding a little baking soda in a, uh, a bowl, put some in a bowl, about a, maybe about a tablespoon full with maybe about um, an ounce of, of shampoo. And just go with a soft toothbrush and, ro and rotate it over the scalp. And you will feel so awesome when that is done. Awesome. So how does the product help with gray hair? Well, just like it would with any hair, the only thing about gray hair sometimes, it's very stubborn. It has no, um, it's, it has no pigments. So, and it's not gonna turn it yellow or anything. That's a lot of people be afraid that it's gonna pick up yellow. It's not gonna do right. 
So you you'll be fine. It should give you um, good moisture. That's what you're looking for. Hair contains moisture and protein, and when you use it, you got great moisture in there. So you I can tell you, for me, it the the gray that I'm allowing to show, <laughs> it is a, it's actually shined it up um and giving it a good sheen just like the rest of my hair um so what i allow to show um actually looks pretty good um let's see uh the teresa says she loves the oodle she loves to put it on her hair and her body um thank you for answering my question okay I think that might be all of our questions, Doris. What's a back bar for stylists? Do you have a back bar for stylists? I know. What does that mean? The back bar mean that we have the 16 and 32 ounces. We don't have that yet, but that is coming. Because right now we just have re more basically retail size, which is the eight ounces. But we get in the 16 ounces, uh, 32 ounces, that's the back bar. And I'm sure we eventually would get up to gallons. But we're introducing it as you uh, get it off the shelf, this round here off the shelf. See, there's no sense in bringing in the other until we get this off. And you, uh, you're you going to fall in love with it. You know, I ain't going to even say you're not going to. You're going to fall in love with it. And as this move out, and then I'm sure that's a question for Melissa also, but I'm just sharing that with you. But that's what back bar is. Back bar is what. So we what we really should do is if we're interested in back bar is everybody get all the hairstylists they know to listen to this call because this is uh, some amazing benefits that people have gotten and continue to. So that would definitely help. So Monday, we know that most hairstylists are off. That's why Doris and Kathy do this awesome call. So let's go to work, everybody and get as many hairstylists on here as we can so they can get educated about CBD because this industry is just going to blow up. So we might as well get in front of it and have our play, our uh, product in stores, having the, what is it, uh, the salon? The, yes, the salon yeah, that's going to be so much fun, guys. Salons and uh, hairstylists, let's go to work and get as many people as we can hairstylist on this call every Monday. And if we have to do some more, I'm sure we'll figure that out. If yes. there's some more I'm days we need know, to do this on. Still, it's the, the uh, beard oil. See, the one thing I don't, don't want you guys to sleep on, this product is for men, women, and children. Now, the beard oil is part of uh, the men, basically, system. But, you, you, you know, if you got a beard, hey, it's where your follicles are. Let's bring it on. That's right. Hemp powered hair works fantastically for helping filling in a beard to make it full and healthy, just like it does any of your other hair. But it is not the same thing as the oud oil. That's two different products. Someone, Kimberly just asked a question. It went off the screen before I could get it. Can we be, can we just be a part as a hairstylist? I'm not sure what that means. Yeah, you can use the, whatever. You can market and, and buy whatever products you want to use. We don't, uh, we don't uh, require you to buy anything you don't want to use. Only what you need. And if, yeah. Oh, she says she's in the business as a hairstylist only. Yes, Kimberly, please join us as a hairstylist. We're trying to connect to every hairstylist that we can put our hands on at, at the sound of our voices, we want to make sure because we will not be doing a great service if we don't get this in the salons. That's where it got to stop at. The hair loss epidemic can stop right there at the salon, especially if we can get to the school and get the students coming out of beauty school in our SOS system. That's what we want to do. Oh, my. And SOS stands for what? I love this guy. Within our strands. <laughs> our strands. And Doris, tell them about the concept of having certain salons and hairstylists that will be on our approved SOS salon list once we officially finalize that, because that's a big part of it, guys. We want to partner with you and recommend you when we have clients that come in with issues and they're looking for a stylist in their area, you could be approved on our list, right, Doris? Yes, we're in Wakana land. They're going to be looking in our Wakana land. 
and all the hairstylists that really is a, a SOS salon that's going to be, we know in the system, how we know you in the system, because they're going to, they're going to monitor your ordering. Uh, we know if you order uh, $10,000 worth of product this month, you didn't eat it. So that means you're using it. <laughs> so we know you will be one of the salons that we will spotlight. On top of that, we will recommend when clients call in, people call in and ask all the time, who's your SOS salon? Then we're going to look at that list and say, oh, this salon here in Kentucky, they're near you. Why don't you visit them? So you're going to start to build clientele. And right now as salons, we are suffering because of this pandemic. We have lost clients to the salon, to, you know, to home, to wherever, because they're afraid. So now you can build your clientele back up by being a SOS salon and having the opportunity for Wakana land to refer you mm -hmm. clients. So this is exciting all the way around. And this will happen at the beauty bar. How will we know? We're going to be at the beauty bar. <laughs> That's right. What a unique thing to be able to create a niche for salons across the country so that they can have a one of a kind proprietary product. They can't get it anywhere else, but from your salon, um, uh, you know, or someone that has the SOS system. So, you know, that's powerful. Hey, Kimberly, I love what you're doing. She says she's setting up an online for, I think she said school. I'm trying to read it. For stylists. That's awesome. Yeah, for stylists. Great, that's Kim. Awesome. So any questions that we, uh, I need to answer for you, if I can, I would definitely get uh, Doris to come on and we can take care of that. So, yeah. Yes. Way to go, Kimberly. That sounds fantastic. You know, it's this time for us to collaborate, you know, one industry helping the other industry. And so, yeah, this is, this is huge, guys. We need to own our hair care market. Nobody That's else needs to be taking money out of our community. You got that right, Phyllis. Um, there's a question about um, a child's hair. Can you speak more on that? She's talking about dry hair, and I know that our system is very moisturizing and nourishing. Can you just speak to her about her child's hair? Yes, you can You take our moisturizing conditioner, mix it with some oud oil. The child may not want to sit under the dryer. So what you can do is get a hot towel. And once you put the, mix the two together, the oud oil and the um, moisturizing conditioner, put it on after you shampoo, take your hot towel, wrap the child's hair up in a hot towel and put a plastic bag on it. And just let them run around until it cooled down. That's just adding moisture and getting in the, um, the moisturizing conditioner and the oud oil. That should help, really should help them. Love that. And yes, it is recorded. The call is recorded. Woohoo! <laughs> you know, I get excited. Y'all are just doing this thing. I, was I think that I think that that might be all of our questions. Doris, I just appreciate you. I literally learn something new every week. And that's what's so exciting about working with you. Um, I'm so glad that we are blessed at Wakana to have an expert that can answer all of these questions and has put your finger in not literally, but put your finger in putting, <laughs> in putting the product line together so that it's top of the line. I mean, we can't duplicate 46 years of experience, but we can definitely showcase that in our beautiful product line. So thank you so much for the brainchild of the beauty bar and for assisting us and, and pushing us to make sure that we had a system so we can save our strands. Yes. I and they're asking about how to get the recording. So we'll stick that on Facebook. So since you guys are excited about the call today, we'll get that right out there for you. So I'm so excited, you guys. <clears throat> All righty. To happen at Wakana in the hair division, we're gonna make and, this, and I'm I'm expecting this team to make it happen, and that team mean everybody that's on this line today and tomorrow and the next day and forever. Amen. <laughs> That's exactly right. Well, I think after that mic drop, 
all we can say is thank you guys for joining us on today's edition of the virtual hair party saving our strands we want you to tune in with your professional in your area or all the professionals in your area listen we're all striving to make sure that all the professionals know about this because again we want to make sure we're saving our strands we don't need any other um any other community teaching us about our strands we know best about how to do this we have experts in our area that are specific to learning about how this now with that said our products are great for any hair type because we know that in our community we have all different types of hair you know mine is super super coarse and super dry but um these products have really assisted me huh I said I got two different textures. Back here, I got one texture. Okay. And then you got the soft in the top? Yeah. <laughs> well, not any of my hair is soft. It's always been really coarse. Um, and so everybody from every hair texture, Melissa has super soft hair. And, you know, there's other hair textures. I think um, Phyllis's are really, is really fine. So any hair texture that you're talking about from natural to relaxed to somewhere in between, this system has been and proven a winner. So we're just excited to be able to share this with you guys. And, um, can we get a video to send? Yes. I just want to clear up something else. Because yes, ma'am. I know I've, me and Phyllis, we've, I've seen her and hung out with the hair with her. Phyllis has the type of hair a lot of people will say, Phyllis has good hair. <laughs> <laughs> I want people to know that when you say a person has good hair, it's Thank the condition the hair is in. You have good hair. I have good hair because we have good condition hair. Somebody yeah. look at my hair and might say, you got some bad hair, but they just don't know. And here at Wakana, we want to clear up that myth. Feels That's right. Good condition hair. Beautiful curly hair. I have good condition hair. Yeah. Just, type is not the same. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly right. <laughs> have those kind of conversations in the beauty bar. So, That's true. <laughs> Hey, and one thing I'd like to say for the, all the guests on the line, I think this was a phenomenally great call. And if you wish somebody had been on this line with information, you should make sure they're here tonight at our corporate grand opening at 8 p.m. Central. And all you got to do is dial in to Zoom in with Wakana.com. I'm going to put that in the chat. <laughs> You got it, Phyllis? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Margie. I just talked to Margie today. Look at that. And Melissa, thank you so much for that journey this morning you took us on. Oh, my God. <laughs> I laughed all the way because I was there. <laughs> you were with us. You know, girl. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> it brought back oh, memories, my God. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> That was inspired. And I was like, is, is Melissa crying? Because I am. I'm back with all those nightmares. I, was, I couldn't do nothing but just smile all the way. I said, come the journey and know you know you don't think. Are they lying? Evangelist Boston was on it today. We need to have a documentary. I'm telling y'all, this coming, right? I really hope y'all are keeping notes and pictures and video oh, and all of that because that's going to be it for the those memories, girl. I the kid, the the un the unsung story. What?